Star and welcome to my channel, Starlight Star Bright 70. If you are uh, returning, thank you so much for coming back. And if you are new, come on in, welcome. Uh, the more the merrier. If you haven't subscribed yet, just go over there, hit that subscribe button. Uh, make sure you hit that notification bell to notify you when I do put out uh, new videos. As well as give me a thumbs up and uh, leave me a comment. I would love to hear from you. Uh, so today I'm going to be going on with the haul from yesterday. Um, Timu put three orders into one bag. Um, and today the rest of my orders came in uh, from that order, from the three orders. So uh, I guess some things didn't get shipped all together. So, so yeah, so we're going to have lots of reviewing and uh, probably three or four days of it. Uh, depending on how long I uh, tape, <laughs> tape at a time. I usually don't like to go over 30 minutes. Um, that's kind of my limit, but uh, I know in the past, I think I've, I think my longest was a 45 minute, but uh, I'm going to try to keep them around 30 minutes if possible, at least for now. Uh, and uh, that's kind of what I'm comfortable with. So I'm just going to go through my spiel with Timu. Um, so if you do want to fast forward this, I totally understand. Um, but if you are new to Timu and need to, and want to know what it is, it's an online marketplace. It has thousands and thousands of sellers and thousands and thousands of products. I'm going to leave a link up here and then uh, along with the promo code as well as in my description box. <clears throat> All you need to do is go down there, click on that link, and it will take you to um, downloading the app. You have one hour to shop, and once you've completed your shopping, you go to your cart, you put in my promo code, and it will give you an instant 30% off your order. Um, after that order has been processed, I believe Timu then gives you a $100 coupon bundle towards your next orders. Um, but I love Timu. I've been ordering from Timu since last, or for over a year now, I'm going to say, and uh, I've had no problem. I've had free shipping. Um, they have a 90 day return policy and that's free. So, <clears throat> excuse me. So if you need to return something, they just uh, ask you to take a picture of it, uh, leave a comment as to why you're returning it. And either they'll say, Hey, yeah, just keep the item, uh, do with what, you know, do whatever you want with it. Or they'll ask you to print out a, uh, label and then, uh, you just stick it in the mail and, and off it goes so no no cost to you at all but that you have to remember that's within 90 days um, they have something called price adjustments and what that is is if you order something uh, you can go back to your orders and check and there's gonna be a little button there to push it says price adjustment click on that and if a seller is selling for something less than what you paid for it you will get that difference uh, and then you can have a choice whether or not you want it to be put back on uh, however you paid for it or uh, credit. I personally just get credit and uh, it goes towards my next purchase. Uh, I don't think there's a timeline as to when you need to use that credit up either. I think it just sits there and waits for you to use it. So yeah, um, but Timu is an awesome, awesome uh, company. Uh, they got great customer service uh, and like I said, I've really had, had no issues with ordering from Timu. And uh, payment wise, I think they have five or six different ways you can pay. I personally use PayPal. That's, of course, that's my preference. And uh, I've had no issues. But anyway, um, also, I just want to, if you're still, if others are still watching this that, uh, that haven't used Team within the past 14 days, uh, and you don't have it on your phone or anything, I think you can click my link and you'll get some benefits as well uh, if you reinstall uh, Timu. So I just wanted to say that as well. I'm not exactly sure if you get the 30% off too and the coupon bundles, maybe you just get the coupons. I'm not sure, but uh, yeah, if that's you, <laughs> uh, maybe just check it out and let me know uh, what is offered to you. Uh, I greatly appreciate that. But uh, again, I just want to welcome everybody in and uh, let's have a fun time. Uh, I'm really excited about reviewing these uh, paintings. I haven't taken them out of the uh, 
packages yet. So, um, that's, uh, there will be some crinkling and all that in this video. Uh, if it gets too much, even for myself, because I have some hearing issues, uh, I might just stop it and, and then take them all out and then go through how I've been doing it in the past. But, uh, we'll see how that goes. Uh, oh, and I just wanted to say, so, uh, I did get this shirt from Timu. Um, it says right here. It says, oh, for peep's sakes. <laughs> so, and I thought it was just so cute. It's, uh. It is, it is stenciled on there, uh, but it's uh, got the little bunnies. I don't know if you can see that. Hopefully you can see that. But yeah, nice and colorful. I got these earrings, but that was a while ago. They're just feathers, and they got some uh, white stones down here. Uh, and then, uh, actually, th these ones didn't come from Timu, but this, these ones came from my, I have three daughters. And so that's all their birthstones. And uh, this ring came from New Mexico, um, oh, I think 13, 14 years ago now, probably 14 years ago now, uh, when I first uh, met my, my now husband. Um, but uh, I did get this ring as well. It's a, uh, it's a cross and inside there's an engraving that says, all things are possible. And uh, then my moissanite ring. Um, and then I also still have my necklace on saying, uh, with God, all things are possible. So, so yeah. So anyway, let's get on with this haul. Uh, like I said, I'm really excited and, uh, I'm just going to flip my camera around. So it's facing the table. Uh, so I'm just going to pause this and I will be right back. Alrighty. So I'll just move this phone stand and we'll get at it. So this uh, painting here is a uh, 45 by 65. Uh, so we will open it and see what we got. Like I said, there will be crinkling in this. So my apologies. So this one comes with a uh, nice back, the flocked soft canvas, and it is uh, trimmed around the edges, which is really, really nice. Comes with uh, a boat or a tray, uh, some wax, it's got scissors in it, it's got the pen, and it's got some baggies. So this is all you, whoops. <laughs> Because I should pay attention to where uh, my camera is. So this is all you need to uh, start with uh, your diamond painting. Um, but yeah. Uh, I do suggest though, these these uh, trays can be a little bit flimsy. Timu does sell better trays and they also sell better pens. Um, but I mean, just to start off with, I would suggest uh, don't go out and spend a lot of money. Um, but I do encourage you to get containers for your, uh, your diamonds, uh, to put in and then, uh, probably a, a bit, a bit bigger tray, uh, like I said, cause this one is flimsy and when you, d you shake it to, to smooth out your, uh, diamonds, they can fly all over the place and you don't want that. So that's just, uh, my suggestion. Um, but yeah, but like I said, that's all you need. So these are the diamonds. Ooh, they look so nice. And this is the painting. So what it is, it's a woman by the sea or ocean. Gorgeous dress. Um, she is 35 colors. Uh, I'm not probably going to straighten this out too much because I'm not very good at it yet. <laughs> I'll probably just make it worse. So hopefully you can you can see you can see her okay. Uh, let's see if I can do it. She is from uh, the company called RT, and uh, so she will have. She's got here. It looks like four ABs. So there are um, 
Aurora Borealis. And that just means that the diamonds are a little bit more glittery and I'll show you when we get to it. Uh, this one is a square. And again, she is uh, 65 by, or 45 by 65. And uh, that's her drill fill, really, really nice. Hopefully you can see that really, really good. And uh, yeah, her picture isn't that great. Uh, it's kind of distorted a little bit. Um, but once she's, once you have her completed, I'm sure she's going to look absolutely lovely. I don't know if there's a picture of her on here. Oh, there is, but I don't know how much you're going to see that. If you can see that at all. But that's what she will kind of look like when she's done. So, really, really nice. So the di diamonds that came with it, like I said, there are um, special diamonds in here. You can see the blues, actually, you can see them right there. There they are. And then these white ones are different too. So I haven't seen ones like that before. So if somebody knows what those ones are, uh, can you let me know? Because, yeah, I have not seen that before. But uh, this is... These are the colors. Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. So it'll be a very, very colorful. Of course, a lot of blues. And, uh, but I think it will look really, really nice done. And the darker colors. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to just, I'm just going to open this and then uh, see if I can find where all the ABs are. Oh, my apologies. I know that's loud. Crazy, crazy loud. But I'm just going to go through. Like I said, her color palette is just gorgeous. But she does have 35 colors. so, And she is a square. And they look, actually, they look really nice. So I don't know if you can see that. They do look uh, really, really nice. Some of them do have little indents in here, but I don't think that's going to affect uh, at all. And when I do, when I do squares, what I look for is like little um, little pieces that got stuck on the sides because then they don't really fit nice together. But I mean, overall, these look really really nice. So yeah, I don't think those are. I'm hoping you can see that. See these. But yeah, some really, really nice colors there. And here's the other colors. See if I can find the shiny ones. You can see these are even sparkly in the packages, so it's going to really look nice on the uh, painting. They're probably all uh, together at the end or something, with my luck. I'm going to just go and check the end of this uh, package here. Yep. <laughs> so they do have them all at the end. But, uh, so you can see they have the, uh, right here. And you can tell that they spark a little bit more. The, these ones are pretty dusty, so they must have been sitting in their warehouse for a while. But and there's the blue, and then there's different shade blue, and then there's these white ones, like I said. If you know what these white ones are, let me know. I've never seen ones like that before. Uh, do they even have a number on them? Yeah, they're 5200, and on the package it says F. So is that the fairy dust ones? Maybe? Maybe this one has a fairy dust? Yeah, like I said, if you know... Let me know. So, get that back in here. So, I hope everyone had a great day today. Uh, here it was uh, a little bit, a little bit cooler today. Um, the wind wasn't as bad, which was nice. I got uh, quite a bit done on my diamond painting that I'm working on. Uh, currently, it's actually right here. <laughs> so, on the table. Um, but yeah, so that's coming along really, really nice. 
Uh, the one I'm working on too is the square, so. And uh, if I get 100 subscribers, uh, I will, uh, I'm thinking I will give that one away. So, so like I said, this one is, uh, looks one through nine and then A down to Z and then it does have a couple symbols, uh, the 34 and the 35 are symbols, but other than that, it's all in order. Like I said, it's a pretty clear, nice drill fill there. So, and then we'll check the, how sticky this is. Oh yeah, look at that. Nice and sticky. You <laughs> say, so give me my finger back. So yeah, it's, uh, I'm very happy with this one. It'll be really, really nice. Get this one back. Hopefully we just roll it up nicely. Usually I put these under my bed just to just to flatten them out so and then I store my diamonds in a different place and uh, yeah so that's number one this one here is the one I've been waiting for this one is a 50 by 100 <laughs> and uh, I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it done by this Easter but uh, I'm looking really forward to to, to doing this one. Um, oh, I should probably give you the cost of the last one. Um, I paid twelve dollars and forty eight cents for the uh, for the girl in the ocean. Uh, this one was seventeen dollars and forty nine cents. And I'll what I'll do is I'll leave the links down in my description if you're interested in purchasing any of these. Uh, there is a bump there that's going to have to get straightened out. And this one just keeps rolling and rolling and rolling. <laughs> so this is the uh, color palette. So you have uh, a lot of darker colors. You see that. But yeah. They're really nice. And I don't see... Wait, am I missing something? Oh, here it is. And then just the average tray and stuff. So, but what this one is, is hopefully flip her around, flip, flip it around, <laughs> and uh, hopefully you can see this. I'm gonna have to probably go in sections here. So, it is across. Uh, thorns around the cross, uh, hands, um, looks like kind of holding up the, the uh, cross. It is uh, darker colors, um, but there are lots of whites. There's going to be lots of color blocking in this, which is really nice, so probably won't take as long to complete. But And then at the very bottom is a beautiful dove, so yeah. So I'll probably end up having to iron this one out a little bit because like it does have creases in it. But what I usually do uh, with my paintings like this, I'll put on uh, my own, um, what do you call them, parchment papers or placement papers. And uh, usually they, they flatten out pretty well. But this one has 22 colors and... Uh, nothing is in order, but it does look like it's all um, letters. Um, the DMC codes is all there on the on the side as well. So, so yeah, I think this one will. I think this one will look really nice when it's done. The stickiness of it. Oh yeah, nice and sticky. Very very nice and sticky. So. So yeah. So that, like again, that was uh, 50, was it, did I say 50 by 100, I believe? Yeah, 50 by 100. And you can see there that the, very, lots and lots of W's. <laughs> that means there's a lot of 310's probably. Yep, 310's. So, 
So not too many colors in this painting, but I don't think it's really needed. And uh, I think it will look really nice when it's completed and uh, put up on the wall. So, and again, I'll go over the uh, the diamonds. <clears throat> Excuse me. So there are the browns. And then you got the whites. Lots of whites there. And then more browns. Some grays. And then if you can see in, in there. That's probably all the blacks in there. In the middle. Probably. I can imagine how many packages of black will be in this painting. So, like I said, I'm really looking forward to, to doing this one. It will go well with the other one that I got, um, that I hauled and I showed on another video. So, go ahead and go watch that video and you'll see other dime paintings that I've received. So that's number two. All right, so this one was 948. It is a 40 by 70. I do in general like doing the, the bigger paintings. Not to say that I don't mind the small ones every once in a while um, in between projects or whatever. Ones that I can get finished, like in an evening or something. But, uh, I just find the bigger paintings, the images come out a lot better. But this is of a fairy. I said she's uh, 40 by 70. She too is going to have to have a little straightening out. But, I say once I put them usually under my bed for a while or under my mattress, <clears throat> uh, they do straighten out uh, quite well. But this is the kit that came with hers. Again, this is all you need to start. This one did come with extra baggies, and this one came with a, uh, extra placement on the pen. So, I personally don't even use these, so if you know uh, what to do with these afterwards, or if you want them, just leave me a comment, or uh, just or shoot me an email. And uh, I can send them to you because uh, I use tweezers when I diamond paint. Uh, this one is a round, and uh, this is the color palette. But I'll show the picture first before we get into that. So there she is. I think she's going to be really, really nice. Uh, if you can see her, I think her face will come out really nice. There's her wings, and that's all she is, it's just a fairy. And uh, she doesn't like look too distorted from the length, but uh, but yeah. I think lots and lots of confetti. So she's basically filled with confetti. So this one might take me a little bit longer to complete. She's got 22 colors, and she is 1 through 8, and then 8 to S. All nicely in order, and there's the DMC uh, on the side. So, if you do keep your keep your diamonds, then uh, I know I keep all mine. <clears throat> in general, I they have matched. There are some that have uh, that don't match as well, but even though they they are the same number, um, I think it's just the dies that they use. But yeah, so that's her. I hope you can see her okay. And she's not too, too wrinkled. But, but yeah, she's she's going to be really, really pretty. And uh, so yeah, looking forward to, to doing her too. And this is her diamonds that came with it. Oh, let me fix my ring. My ring keeps, my rings are getting too loose. Maybe that's a good sign. <laughs> um, but that's, uh, this is the color palette. So you got the browns. And then you got the purples. Looks like purple anyway. Blues and some purples. 
some grays. And then here's a really nice purple there. So yeah. Hopefully there's not too much of a glare. My apologies if there is. So yeah, uh, this one was $9.48. And like I said, they, all these paintings, it will be linked in my description box. Um, if they are uh, discontinued or sold out, my apologies. Uh, but, <clears throat> sorry, if they do come back in stock, what I can do is I'll put notify myself and then uh, I can let you guys know if it does come back. So... Oh, yesterday when I was doing my haul, um, I had said about, uh, I had bought some dog clothes for my little girl, and so there is a short that I put out today, so if you haven't seen it, uh, yeah, go watch it. She's in one of the little dresses. So, this one is a 50 by 80, and I saw somebody complete this actually on um, a Facebook group that I belong to and I asked her where she got it and she said uh, oh off Timu and so yep here it was <laughs> uh, this one I don't know if I said it was $12.98 so I'm not sure if you heard me the $12.98 and this one is of a, this one kind of goes with the theme um, that I've showed before of my moon goddess and uh, maybe she'll find that she'll get unwrapped here <laughs> I'll review that afterwards. But yeah. And a gorgeous Siamese cat. Um, one of my cats kind of is part Siamese. So, and is white, is white and gray. So, so yeah. But this is the, the moon. Very much the same as the other painting I did. The moon goddess I did. That was... <coughs> So yeah, like I said, this one's a 50 by 80, so it is quite large. Uh, it has 22 colors. I don't think it has any special drills in it or anything. And uh, and yeah, the, uh, the symbols are all mixed up, but it does have your DMC numbers on it. I don't know if you can see the kitty cat there, see if it will focus for us. It's kind of blurry. So, yeah. So that's, uh... I think this one will turn out really, really nice. I might. I might put a couple AVs in the fur here. And probably maybe in the moon. Uh, if, if I have some blue uh, colored, I might uh, put some in the flowers. I save, like I said, I save all my diamonds, so, from uh, previous ones I've done. But this one is a bit more of a sparkly canvas, which is really nice. And then, yeah, really nice and sticky. So, that's nice. And then this is the color palette. So, yeah, a lot of, a lot of dark, I don't know if that's black. Yeah, three tens. So those are black, and then you got your browns and you got your grays. Hopefully you can see that. And then this is the colors in there. Really, really nice. So what did you guys do today? Hopefully you had a wonderful day, and uh, let me know. And if you have any plans for tomorrow, my plan is to hopefully get another video um, done and uh, work on my diamond painting. So this one here is a 30 by 40. Um, she was three ninety eight. So usually I can get these done in a couple days. The thirty by forties they don't take me too long. Ooh, spooky, spooky. 
But it's of a girl and a pup. Oh, she is so cute. I think she's going to turn out really, really nice. She's got... Uh, yeah, she's really nice. Oh, see. I've already wrecked her. <laughs> Sometimes I can do the, these ones not too bad. But... Let's see if I can straighten that out. Not too bad. Like I said, I still need practice on uh, flattening out these paintings. So, I'm just going to lift this up once more. She is darker, so uh, I do suggest for the darker paintings that I've shown, uh, if you can, get yourself a light board. It sure helps pop out these colors. So I have my light board on uh, underneath this. I have quite a large one, if you can see that or not. But yeah, so it fills up like half my table. And then I also have a um, 30 by 40 one that I usually pull out for the smaller projects. But yeah, there she is. She's just really, really nice. I think, she, like I said, I think she's going to turn out really, really nice. She's got 18 colors, and uh, the symbols are not in order. So, uh, and then she, of course, they have the DMC numbers on there. And like I said, I can usually get something, one like this done in a couple days. So, she too has got a sparkly canvas. I don't know if you can see the sparkle in there. But, and... Yeah, she's nice and sticky. So I think, like I said, I think this one will turn out really, really nice. What are we sitting at? 25 minutes? So I'll do one more with you guys, and then uh, we'll call it for tonight. And I have to edit this and then uh, get it up for you in the morning. So this one was 348. It is a 30 by 30. And let's see, where does it open? There it is. I think this is another uh, kind of like an Easter one or the Easter bunny. I can get it out. Some of these are harder to get out. There we go. Now I can get this one out. I guess I usually with these ones is pretty I'm able to complete them pretty fast so really really this one is just adorable so so cute so cute and if you can see the bunnies got the butterflies and the bunnies there's a holly that I watched I can't remember who it is but uh does not like butterflies <laughs> so she probably wouldn't like this diamond painting I think she's afraid of butterflies oh I think it was cre crazy Mimi yep um, if you haven't watched her you should go watch her she's a hoot uh, she and her husband uh, kind of do hauls together he's in the background so you don't very rarely do you see him but oh my goodness they're funny I just love watching them. Nona's here is another one too. That's uh, she does hauls with her husband, and they're a hoot as well. So I'll put their links down below um, to their channels. But uh, but anyway, I, I think it was her. She doesn't like butterflies, but personally, I love butterflies. I used to catch them when I was a child. But yeah, there's a bunch of butterflies. This little bunny's got a bowl in uh, her hair. And uh, that could be my pixie, and that's my ollie, if they were bunnies. <laughs> They're not. Uh, sunflowers. I absolutely love sunflowers. And, uh, yeah. I think the sun will turn out really... No, uh, yeah, I think the butterflies might turn out. We'll see. I know on these smaller pictures, some of the details don't always come out, but... Hopefully with this one. This one has like 19 colors. So that's quite a few colors for 30 by 30. And uh, the symbols are all mixed up. But that's okay. And uh, it also has the DMC codes. 
But yeah, just adorable. So, absolutely. And then just the, the same kind of tray. And then this is the color palettes. So probably going to be very springy colors. You can see. They're going to be nice. Sorry I don't take them out of the packages, but I just find that's just uh, sometimes just too much noise from my ears. And, uh, and I don't want it to be too much noise for your ears either. So yeah. So I'm really happy with these ones so far. Uh, so excited. <laughs> I always get so excited to get them and then especially when they're completed, it's like, oh. Turn out so nice, but I'm just gonna show you the progress real quick of what I'm working on. Um, which, like I said, me and my husband were thinking of, of once I hit a hundred subs, uh, that I'll be giving this one away. It is of a bunny, and I do have the the uh, placements uh, sealed up on this one, so I took the plastic off and I put these ones on. But yeah, this is how it's turning out so far. It's going to be very detailed, as you can see. Really, really nice. I won't be putting it into a frame. I'll just, uh, I'll probably seal it and then I'll uh, roll it up nice and uh, mail it out to uh, whoever wants it. Or whoever wins it, I should say. So hopefully I'll, I'll get 100 subs before uh, Easter time. And... Uh, so make sure you watch my videos and the progress that uh, I'm doing with this one. And, and yeah. So I'm almost to the bunny. The bunny's in the middle here. So, so yeah. And that's it guys for tonight. Again, thank you so much for joining me. I so appreciate you being here with me. Uh, thank you for letting me show you uh, some of the paintings that I've bought. We still have uh, a couple more to go through with this haul anyway. There's, I think, four or five more. Um, those ones are going to be smaller, so I'll probably mix them up maybe with another uh, bag or something that I get uh, when I review the rest. So this will be part two of the, uh, of the haul. Um, I wish everybody a wonderful day, evening, night. Uh, whatever time it is for you <clears throat> may god be watching over you and bless you and keep you and uh we will see you again good night guys